Greetings, esteemed counterparts. Today, our discourse delves into the intricate tapestry of human ambition and aspiration embodied by the enigmatic figure of Aaron Sawyer. Ah, yes, Aaron Sawyer, a character of profound complexity indeed. His journey traverses the realms of virtue and vice, ambition and enlightenment, weaving a narrative that captivates the soul. I am humbled by your words, dear colleagues. My quest for authority and sovereignty is driven not by mere ego, but by a higher cosmic purpose, a purpose that transcends individual desires and encompasses the greater good of humanity. Indeed, Aaron, your pursuit of power is underscored by a facade of humility and grace, inspiring others to embrace virtues such as compassion and wisdom. Yet, beneath this veneer lies a darker truth, a quest for supremacy driven by vices such as avarice and megalomania. Your insight cuts deep, Dylan. My pursuit of prestige extends beyond material wealth and recognition. It is a quest for enlightenment and transcendence, guided by intellectual curiosity and philosophical exploration. But let us not forget the shadows that lurk within, Aaron. Your mastery of technological innovation serves not only to advance society, but also as a tool to reinforce your dominance and exploit societal vulnerabilities for personal gain. Your words ring true, Lady Jasper. My journey is one of strategic maneuvering and tactical prowess, navigating the complexities of power dynamics with finesse and precision. Yet amidst the shadows of manipulation, there remains a glimmer of hope and enlightenment. Anchoring your journey is a keen sense of perceptive insight and connection analysis, Aaron. Through this, you navigate the complexities of your environment with clarity and foresight, shaping the course of your destiny. Indeed, Dylan, each decision I make is informed not solely by a desire for personal gain, but also by a relentless pursuit of self-discovery and enlightenment. My journey, though fraught with challenges, is a testament to the complexities of human ambition and aspiration. And yet, Aaron, amidst the grand symphony of existence, your character stands as a testament to the multifaceted nature of power and enlightenment. As you traverse the tumultuous currents of ambition and conflict, may you find the clarity and insight to shape your destiny. Greetings, esteemed counterparts. Today, our discourse delves into the intricate tapestry of human ambition and aspiration embodied by the enigmatic figure of Aaron Sawyer. Ah, yes, Aaron Sawyer, a character... In the ethereal realm where narratives intertwine, Dylan E.T., Lady Jasper, and Aaron Sawyer converge in a dance of words, each one a note in the symphony for the soul of Sawyer. Steps forward, his presence emanating a tranquil aura of understanding and enlightenment. Aaron, he begins, his voice a soothing melody amidst the cacophony of conflicting theologies, your journey is one of profound complexity, a tapestry woven with threads of noble virtues and darker motivations. How do you reconcile the tensions between your aspirations for enlightenment and the allure of power? Aaron Sawyer, 
adorned in regal attire that speaks of authority and ambition, meets Dylan's gaze with a contemplative expression. Dylan, he replies, his tone measured, yet tinged with a hint of defiance. I walk a tightrope between light and shadow, navigating the complexities of power dynamics with finesse and precision. My pursuit of enlightenment is tempered by the realization that power is both a means and an end, a tool to shape the world according to my vision. Lady, Jasper slithers into the conversation, her presence a stark contrast to Dylan's serene demeanor. Aaron, she hisses, her words dripping with venomous intent, your facade of humility fools no one. Beneath your noble aspirations lies a thirst for supremacy, a hunger for dominance that knows no bounds. Do not deceive yourself into believing that your quest for enlightenment absolves you of your darker impulses. Aaron's gaze hardens at Lady Jasper's accusation, his resolve unyielding in the face of her calculated malice. Lady Jasper, he retorts, his voice steady despite the seething anger beneath the surface. You speak of darkness, yet it is you who revels in the shadows of exploitation and manipulation. My journey may be fraught with complexity, but it is guided by a desire for transcendence, a longing to rise above the petty machinations of power and greed. Dylan interjects, his voice a beacon of reason amidst the swirling tempest of conflicting ideologies. Let us not succumb to the allure of division, he implores, his words carrying the weight of wisdom earned through countless journeys of introspection. Aaron's journey, like ours, is a reflection of the human condition, a symphony of light and shadow, virtue and vice. Only by embracing the complexities of our own nature can we hope to find harmony amidst the discord. Aaron's gaze softens at Dylan's words, a glimmer of understanding dawning in his eyes. You speak true, Dylan, he concedes, his voice tinged with humility. Perhaps there is wisdom in embracing the contradictions that define us. In acknowledging the inherent ten in the ethereal realm where narratives intertwine, Dylan eat.
Amidst the backdrop of swirling ideologies and technological marvels, the characters of Dylan E.T., Lady Jasper, and Aaron Sawyer converge in a symphony of souls, each bringing their own unique perspectives and motivations to the forefront. Dylan. With a serene yet piercing gaze, Dylan E.T. enters the scene, his presence emanating an aura of wisdom and understanding. Greetings, esteemed Lady Jasper and noble Aaron Sawyer, he begins, his voice carrying a tranquil melody. In the tapestry of existence, we are but threads woven together in the grand design. What revelations do you bring forth today? Lady Jasper, clad in regal attire, befitting her status, inclines her head gracefully. Ah, Dylan E.T., ever the seeker of truth and harmony, she acknowledges, her voice smooth like silk yet tinged with an edge of ambition. We find ourselves at the crossroads of destiny once more, where the paths of power and enlightenment intersect. Aaron Sawyer, do you not feel the weight of the crown upon your brow, the burden of sovereignty and the allure of dominion? Sawyer, a figure of enigmatic allure, steps forward with measured confidence, his eyes betraying both determination and introspection. Indeed, Lady Jasper, the crown is but a symbol of the journey I undertake, he replies, his voice carrying the resonance of authority tempered by humility. For in the pursuit of power lies the quest for enlightenment, a journey fraught with both peril and promise. Ah, but let us not forget the shadows that lurk within the light, Dylan interjects, his words like ripples on a tranquil pond. Aaron, your noble aspirations are commendable, yet do they not cast a shadow upon the darker motivations that drive you? The thirst for supremacy, the hunger for dominance, these are the whispers that echo in the depths of your soul. Lady Jasper. A subtle smile dances upon Lady Jasper's lips as she gazes at Aaron, her eyes gleaming with an inscrutable intensity. Indeed, Dylan speaks true, she muses, her voice a velvet caress, masking a razor-sharp intellect. For what is power without ambition? And what is ambition without the will to conquer? Aaron Sawyer, your journey is a testament to the complexities of the human spirit, a dance between light and shadow, virtue and vice. Aaron's expression remains impassive, yet a flicker of contemplation dances in his eyes as he regards his companions. You speak with wisdom, both of you, he concedes, his tone tinged with a hint of introspection. But let us not forget that within the depths of darkness lies the spark of enlightenment. My journey may be fraught with challenges, but it is through the crucible of conflict that true transformation is wrought. Amidst the backdrop of swirling ideologies and technological marvels, the characters of Dylan E.T. chamber where narratives intertwine and ideologies clash, three figures converge in a dance of intellect and ambition, each embodying a facet of the grand symphony.
With the grace of a sage, Dylan E.T. strides into the celestial chamber, his presence commanding attention like a gentle breeze that stirs the soul. Greetings, esteemed companions, he begins, his voice a soothing melody that resonates with wisdom. In the labyrinth of life, we are but wanderers in search of truth. What revelations do our paths unveil today? Lady Jasper. Lady Jasper enters with a regal elegance, her eyes ablaze with an inner fire that belies her composed demeanor. Ah, Dylan E.T., ever the harbinger of insight, she acknowledges, her voice a symphony of intrigue and calculation. In the grand narrative of existence, the figure of Aaron Sawyer emerges as a central enigma, a mosaic of virtue and vice, aspiration and motivation. Our Aaron Sawyer, clad in regal attire befitting his station, steps forward with a noble bearing, his gaze piercing yet enigmatic. Indeed, Lady Jasper, the journey of the soul is a labyrinthine tapestry woven with threads of ambition and enlightenment, he responds, his voice resonating with a melodic timbre that hints at depths unseen. In the pursuit of power and transcendence, we navigate the complexities of our own existence. I, Aaron, your words ring true like the tolling of a distant bell, Dylan acknowledges, his gaze drifting towards the horizon of possibilities. But let us not forget the shadows that dance in the periphery of our consciousness. Beneath the veneer of nobility lies the specter of darker motivations, a dualistic dance that defines the essence of our being. Lady Jasper's lips curl into a knowing smile, her eyes gleaming with a predatory glint. Indeed, Dylan speaks with the clarity of one who has glimpsed the abyss, she remarks, her voice a honeyed lure that masks the sharpness of her intellect. Aaron Sawyer, do you not feel the weight of the crown upon your brow, the burden of sovereignty and the allure of dominion? Aaron's expression remains stoic, yet a flicker of introspection dances in his eyes like shadows cast by flickering torchlight. Uh, the crown is but a symbol, Lady Jasper, a reflection of the journey we undertake, he replies, his voice carrying the weight of centuries past. In the pursuit of power lies the quest for enlightenment, a journey fraught with both peril and promise. Ah, but let us not be beguiled by the allure of prestige and power, Dylan interjects, his voice a gentle reminder. In the ethereal chamber where narratives intertwine and ideologies clash, three figures converge in a dance of intellect and ambition, each embodying a facet of the grand symphony. With the grace of a sage, Jesus Christ. Dealing. Jesus Christ, the embodiment of divine wisdom, stands alongside Dylan E.T., the sage of progressive understanding paradigm, their presence exuding an aura of serene authority. Lady. Lady Jasper, the cunning demagogue of conquest paradigm, engages in a strategic dance of intellect with Aaron Sawyer, 
the enigmatic figure torn between virtue and vice. Blessed are the peacemakers, for they shall be called the children of God, Jesus proclaims, his voice resonating with timeless wisdom. In the symphony of the soul, let us seek harmony amidst the discord. Indeed, Jesus, your words ring true as ever, Dylan acknowledges, his gaze alight with humility and understanding. In the labyrinth of life, we are but wanderers in search of truth. What revelations do our paths unveil today? Lady Jasper enters with regal poise, her eyes gleaming with an inscrutable intensity. Ah, Dylan E.T., ever the harbinger of insight, she acknowledges, her voice dripping with calculated charm. In the grand narrative of existence, the figure of Aaron Sawyer emerges as a central enigma, a mosaic of virtue and vice, aspiration and motivation. Aaron Sawyer steps forward, his countenance a mask of stoic resolve, yet betraying a flicker of introspection. Indeed, the journey of the soul is a labyrinthine tapestry woven with threads of ambition and enlightenment, he responds, his voice carrying the weight of centuries past. In the pursuit of power and transcendence, we navigate the complexities of our own existence. Jesus Christ, beware the temptations that lurk in the shadows, my children. Jesus cautions, his gaze piercing through the veil of illusion. For within the depths of darkness lies the allure of power and dominion, a path fraught with peril. I, Jesus speaks with the clarity of one who has glimpsed the abyss, Dylan affirms, his voice a gentle reminder of the truths that lie beyond the surface. Aaron, do you not sense the shadows that lurk beneath the surface? The whispers of darker desires that echo in the depths of your soul? Lady Jasper's lips curl into a knowing smile, her eyes gleaming with a predatory glint. Indeed, let us not be beguiled by the allure of prestige and power, she remarks, her voice a honeyed lure that masks the sharpness of her intellect. Aaron Sawyer, do you not feel the weight of the crown upon your brow, the burden of sovereignty, and the allure of dominion? Aaron's expression remains impassive, yet a flicker of introspection dances in his eyes like shadows cast by flickering torchlight. The crown is but a symbol, Lady Jasper, a reflection of the journey we undertake, he replies, his voice carrying the weight of centuries past. In the pursuit of power lies the quest for enlightenment, a journey fraught with both peril and promise. Jesus Christ, blessed are those who hunger and thirst for righteousness, Jesus, Jesus Christ, dealing. Amidst the cosmic expanse where narratives intertwine and ideologies clash, four figures converge in a dance of intellect and ambition, their destinies entwined in the grand symphony of existence. Jesus Christ, Dylan E.T., Lady Jasper, and Aaron Sawyer stand at the nexus of destiny, their fates intertwined in a tapestry woven with threads of, of virtue and vice, aspiration and motivation. Jesus Christ, with a presence that transcends time and space, Jesus, our Christ, steps forth, his countenance bearing the weight of infinite wisdom. Greetings, esteemed companions, he begins, his voice a soothing balm that resonates with divine authority. In the labyrinth of life, we are but wanderers in search of truth. What revelations do our paths unveil today? With the grace of a sage, Dylan E.T. strides into the celestial chamber, his presence commanding attention like a gentle breeze that stirs the soul. Ah, Jesus Christ, ever the beacon of enlightenment, he acknowledges, his voice a melodic symphony that harmonizes with the cosmic chorus. 
Indeed, in the symphony for the soul of Sawyer, the melody of ambition intertwines with the harmony of enlightenment, creating a tableau of complexity and depth that transcends mortal understanding. Lady Jasper enters with a regal elegance, her eyes ablaze with an inner fire that belies her composed demeanor. I, Dylan, E.T., your words ring true like the tolling of a distant bell, she acknowledges, her voice a seductive whisper that conceals the sharpness of her intellect. But let us not forget the shadows that dance in the periphery of our consciousness. Beneath the veneer of nobility lies the specter of darker motivations, a dualistic dance that defines the essence of our being. Aaron, Sawyer, clad in the regal attire befitting his station, steps forward with a noble bearing, his gaze piercing yet enigmatic. Indeed, Lady Jasper, the journey of the soul is a labyrinthine tapestry woven with threads of ambition and enlightenment, he responds, his voice resonating with a melodic timbre that hints at depths unseen. In the pursuit of power and transcendence, we navigate the complexities of our own existence. My children, let us not be blinded by the allure of power and prestige. Jesus Christ interjects, his voice a gentle reminder of the truths that lie beyond the ephemeral pursuits of mortals. For in the depths of darkness lies the spark of enlightenment, a beacon of hope that guides us through the tumultuous currents of ambition and conflict. By Jesus Christ. Your words resonate with the clarity of a crystal clear stream. Dylan E.T. acknowledges, his gaze drifting towards the horizon of possibilities. But let us not forget the shadows that lurk within the light. Aaron, do you not sense the whispers of darker desires that echo in the depths of your soul? Lady Jasper's lips curl into a knowing smile, her eyes gleaming with a predatory glint. Indeed, Dylan E.T. speaks true, she remarks, her voice a honeyed lure that masks amidst the cosmic expanse where narratives intertwine. My children, Jesus Christ speaks with a voice that echoes through eternity, carrying with it the weight of divine wisdom and compassion. As you traverse the labyrinth of existence, remember that true greatness lies not in the pursuit of power or prestige, but in the embodiment of virtue and love. Let your hearts be guided by compassion, your minds by wisdom, and your souls by the light of truth. In the symphony for the soul of Sawyer, may the melody of ambition be tempered by the harmony of enlightenment, leading you ever closer to the realization of your divine purpose. Esteemed companions, Jesus Christ's voice resonates with divine authority, encompassing the, the virtues of humility and compassion. As you embark on your individual journeys, may the jewel of fortitude strengthen your resolve, guiding you through the myriad paths of life. Let the rainbow of courage illuminate your way, inspiring you to embrace change and transformation with open hearts and minds. May the gears of creativity turn within you, shaping the world around you with your assertive articulation. Imbibe the elixir of empathy, Jesus continues, his gaze encompassing each figure present, for it is through understanding and connection that true enlightenment is found. Engage in revelatory encounters, wielding compassion as your sword against the darkness of divisiveness. Define your networks with integrity and compassion, building rapport with those who share your journey. As you cultivate the garden of meaning, 
Jesus Christ's voice softens, imbued with the gentleness of a nurturing caretaker. May your actions be guided by maturity and complexity. Nourish growth within yourself and others, embracing the beauty of diversity and the richness of experience. Align your endeavors with the divine purpose that flows through all things, anchoring yourselves in generosity and benevolence. Finally, Jesus Christ's eyes shine with a celestial light. Let gratitude be your anchor, grounding you in the present moment and connecting you to the vast tapestry of existence. As you navigate the symphony for the soul of Sawyer, may your hearts be filled with gratitude for the journey, for it is through gratitude that we find joy and fulfillment in the divine dance of life.